a core. Okay, but I want you to be able to share your screen. Yes. My house, but in my room, I don't want to. <clears throat> Okay, I think we got okay. it. Cool. Perfect. All right, guys. If y'all are ready to hear my strategy on how I am gaining leads every single day for my app, drop some fire. Okay. Because literally, um, it's brilliant. Okay. And it's not me. I'm not the smart guy gave all this to me, my creative brain. I'm realizing all these things. Um, but when I did this, I was like, holy crap, this is the best strategy ever. Okay. So I'm going to show you exactly what I do. Now the details are going to be different for you because it depends on what your niche is and what you are doing. Okay. So whether you're talking about libido gummies, pink pills, the new lemon squeezy, the new go flex, whatever this strategy works, but you just apply it to whatever you are doing. Okay. So the first thing that I do is I make sure that I'm creating engaging um, enticing, curious content. Okay. I've done many trainings on that before. You can go back and look at all that stuff, but you really want to tap into your audience, what they are looking for. Um, I'll, I talked on stage a lot about this, but really knowing who you're talking to is going to be important. Okay. So you want to create catchy, quick videos to put on I've been doing this mostly on Facebook. So this strategy is more for Facebook. You can do this on different just because you can't put links in your comments on TikTok because then TikTok will block you. So this is what I'm doing. So I'll make, uh, and I'll do this example because this is what I do every day. I started tapping into the Vibe High End Show. Okay. I've been talking about um, being an overwhelmed, overstimulated mom, right? So I created a video that was very catchy that everyone would be able to relate to. Uh, that's like me. Okay. The tip that I gave everybody and their minds are like, Phew. Talk to your former self. Who were you? Talk to that person. Know all the things that you went through and say, okay, I can speak on this because now I'm on the other side of it. So talk to that person, okay? Whether it's for low libido, weight loss, whatever, talk to that old self, okay? So you're going to create that video. Now, let me go ahead and share my screen. Do, do, do. Screen. Start now. Okay. Oh, it's got to make it this thing okay perfect sorry y'all okay so um i this is what i do so i'm actually going to show you um my video that i made and it's mine are all kind of cringy i feel like sometimes but they work so whatever um sorry let me get to it my reels i never know where to find my actual reels so there's that there it is okay so I did this a while ago, probably December. Yeah, it was December because we were baking. Where is it? Okay. Okay. So what I did is I waited, okay? I waited for people to ask me about it. I don't just throw a link in there, okay? I started having people ask, what is it, okay? What are you doing? So this is what I do. I write a little blurb. Hey, girl, literally like a chill pill that helps me be level-headed, chill, calm throughout the day. More info about them, okay? Here's my app link. Note to self, always put a picture, okay? Always put a picture in the comment because if you don't it's going to say like shop my ariel okay i try to be as curious as possible because if they know what it is they're either gonna be like oh okay well it's ariel or oh okay it's one of those things i make it as curious as possible so they have to go deeper okay so i just put a picture of me with the pink pill i have another one that i have in here somewhere and then some sounds like mlm but okay what we're gonna do is we're going to uh sorry dang it sorry i like to delete those comments because then you have all those crazy people come and like go ham on you for no freaking reason. So I just will take, take this. If it'll let me, maybe not. Okay. Well, it's not letting me right now, but I'll go back. So yeah, basically I just take a comment I'm trying to find another one that I did. Okay. So like this, 
High Vibe and Chill, you can have, find it at, and I got a, I also got a web page, so I did both. So I can do a GoDaddy link or I can do, but I want them in the app because I want them to be a lead, okay? So what then I do, this is what I did. Uh, I already rated it, so I'll do that later. Um, okay, so in my tools, I created on Canva, and I can share this with people. Um, I created, and I do have to change this. I still have buy three, get one free in there. I haven't changed it yet because of all the stuff that's been happening, but this is what I did. This is the video that I send, or I have in that link and people watch. It's super basic, but this is what I did. Loading. Okay. Okay, and what I did is where it says shop now, I actually have an invisible visible button. So they can click on that. It'll take them directly to Vibe High and Chill. Or they can press at the bottom, info, order, join Ariel, whatever. Okay, so now um, I let that play out. Okay, so now I get leads every day. So now my feed, let me refresh. My feed is just filled, filled with people, okay? Look at this. I have tons of people all the time. And of course, this likes to do this thing where it like doesn't go all the way down. But- um, I have tons more leads in here. So all I do, okay, I've also created, and I'm going to, I'm going to be jumping around a little bit to so stick with me here because it's a lot, but just, just trust me on this. Okay. So what I actually did is I created in my tools, I created this image. Okay. Be happy, not snappy. Right. And so what you can do is when you do this, the title, okay, because I'm going to send emails to people now, okay? So the title is going to be the subject of your email, and then the description is going to be the base of your email, okay? So I have this already set up. Like Darnell said, she was three typing everything. I used to do that too. I'm like, I don't have time for that. I need everything to be in my app so I can just plug and play, plug and play, okay? So what I did is I haven't, again, I haven't updated this yet. Um, I'm going to change this around to be um the subscribe and save and i'll actually show you when i did this card um uh, okay snatched i just did one for snatched um basically what i put is i put thank you so much for your interest if you've recently entered your email on my or you have recently entered your email on my site i was just following up to see if there's any information i could provide for you or any questions i could answer our incredible new clinically backed uh snatch tightening cream blah 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 a little blurb about it and i say when you register for a free vip account there's no authorship requirements or commitments required but you get all the perks the vip perks so i again i had to change this but it says basically you can save 20 percent on all products and you'll unlock exclusive products and then subscribe and save i tell them it's just like amazon subscribe and save um you can have them deliver to your door so you never miss out get a deeper discount discount and it's hundred percent optional. I love to put that because you know, if you know, you can cancel something easily, you're more likely to do it. But if you're like, if it's a whole process, you're, people aren't going to want to do it. So I make that very, very clear to people that, Hey, anytime you need to, you basically just cancel, call and cancel. Okay. So, um, I just make all these for the products that I share. So I have little videos, like here's like in the mood, I did one. Um, so anytime I do the same thing. If I have an in the mood gummy video, I do the same thing. Okay, so I just literally do the same kind of thing for each product that I do this on because it's just simple. I did one for um, GTFO. I did one on how to make money. Just depends on what you're doing, okay? So then what you're going to do is let's say, um, and I'm not going to actually send the email because I already did, but I'll show you. So right here, Rosanna, she said um, she looked at the site. She, she watched the video. She watched 100% of it, and she clicked order. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to click where she is, and I'm gonna share tool, okay? So then I go to find my tools, I find my get the filth out little tool, okay? I just something super simple. I'm not so much worried about the actual image because that image, they had to click on it to see it. I'm more worried about the body of the email, okay? I'm more worried about what this says down here at the bottom, okay? So what I do is I, at the bottom, press email, okay? Click their email, 
And it's going to say, you know, to ensure proper tracking, don't send this to anybody else. Okay. Don't send this link. So then, and since I have multiple emails, I switch it up. Okay. So basically it's going to say, get the filth out. Then it's going to say the whole little blurb that I did. Okay. And something extra that I started doing that I'm like, wow, this is so smart is I added a signature. So now I'm going to change this, but I had the, um, the slim pack in here. This is my signature. So no matter what I do, this is going to be at the bottom of my email. So I don't have to continually plug it in. Okay. I have all the info about it. Right. And then I have, let's connect how to connect with me. Kayla Moat did this. And I was like, Oh, that's so brilliant. So basically I have a way to get in touch with me. Let's face it. Emails suck. People suck at emailing, emailing back. But if you give them all your platforms, one, you could gain followers, but two, they can message you on those different platforms. Okay. Um, so basically I will just take this and then I'll just press send. I've already sent it. So I'm not going to do it. But that's literally all I do, guys. That's all I do. And um, sometimes I get orders, sometimes I don't, but I'm at least piquing the interest. But now what I have is I have literally thousands of people. Look, five high-end chill, five high-end chill. i uh, requested more info. If somebody wants more info, what I do is the same thing. I'll go, um, it depends. Okay, sorry, let me go back. It depends on what they watch. If it just says... Candace visited the site. She requested more info and she pressed order. I don't know what she's looking at. She could be looking at vibe high. She could be looking at in the mood. I don't know. So I have a little email that I generated. Okay. I will just literally email the person straight up. I'll have my separate thing and I'll go, thank, or no, I go more info request. Okay. Then I have a thing again, like Darnell said, my, my, <laughs> my clipboard is full. Okay. And I also have the boards app. So I have the boards app at the bottom right. Uh, or you can't see that part because it's not part of the screen. But um, I just have all these in here. And I think it's this one. Okay, yeah. So I say, hey, thank you so much for your interest. You've recently, recently registered on my site for more information. I was following up to see what information I could provide for you. What were you more interested in? Our, pro our products we offer or the business opportunity? And I just put a little heart in my name. Okay, super simple. I'll send it. I'll go ahead and actually send it because I didn't send anything to her. Okay. And so... It just depends on what they're looking for. If someone clicks join, sometimes I'll send them the join the party video. And then I have another email that I've curated that says um, a little bit about the business and what we do. It's very simple. And I send that. So really, let me go back to Zoom. Sorry, guys. Okay, stop share. Okay, so really that's all I'm doing. That's all I'm doing is I am just plug it and play. Um, again, I have videos. I'm creating more videos. Um, on different things, because I'm a nerd like that, and I like to make graphics, but and videos. But um, honestly, this is huge because I'm telling you, I may not be getting tons of sales every day from them, but I have leads galore. And like we always say, it takes about 14 times for someone to see something before they actually order. So just continue to plug and play with this. Um, if you need additional help, just let me know. Um, I don't know. Well, there was a training on how to like upload your stuff uh, and I'll here. I'll just, well, shoot. I'll just do that really quickly. I'll just show you. Um, I'll share my screen one more time. Okay. So if you go to your, my aerial app, actually here, I'll do this now because I tried to upload my lemon squeezy thing and it didn't work yesterday. So I'm going to try again. Okay. So, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to click video. Okay. And I'm going to upload. I think it was this one I made. Okay. I made this little, nope, it wasn't this one. Kara and Kira had one that they posted. Is it this one? No. Um, about lemon squeezy. So I kind of like took what they had made. Good golly. There's so many freaking videos in this thing. Select from gallery. Where is it? <laughs> okay. Hold on one second. Let me go find it. Did I make it in Canva? If you see my butt on here, I'm so sorry. I've been taking before and after pictures. So sorry. <laughs> sorry, not sorry. Um, okay, it's this one, I think. No, it's not that either. That's part of it. Where did it go? Okay, well, that's exciting. That's part of it, but that's not the whole thing. Where'd it go? Okay. Anyways, sorry. Sidetrack. I'll just delete it later. Um, so let's say that is the video. It's not the video, but let's just use it just for time's sake. 
Okay, so it'll load my video. All I'm gonna do is press save, okay? When you go into, um, when it saves it, I like to add a thumbnail, okay? So I made one. Do, do, I always make a thumbnail, a thumbnail with my video. So I use this, okay, your main squeeze, save. Now what you can do, since it's a video, I technically don't put a description because I'm usually not sending the videos in the email, but you can. You could do like um, your new, oops, can't spell, main squeeze, okay? Then your catchy little email, um, this is our newest um, weight loss vape. Okay, I'm just doing this for you guys. This is not something I'm actually going to share. Okay, I, I just put something in simple and then I have the base of my email, okay? Then you're gonna press next. Then this is where you can add your little button, okay? So what I do is I just go to link button. You'll type your URL. I don't have it. So I'm just gonna throw in my gummy, my, I have um, a generic one that I just send me straight to my email or sorry, straight to my website. And then what I do is I just, so here's the link, right? But if I want to have it not show the little link button, it's gonna let me edit it. Oh yeah, okay, down here. Um, I'm just going to make it invisible. So anywhere that they basically click on the screen, and I like to blow it up if it'll let me, it won't let me right now, but usually I blow it up and I see where the shop now button is. Now, if they press shop now, it's going to take them straight to my site, okay? And then I just press save, okay? It's gonna load. And then it's gonna look it's gonna look like these. And then basically I can copy at the bottom, I can copy the link, I can email it, I can send it in a text message, I can even download it. I can do whatever I want, okay? So this is just the strategy that I've been using. I think it's freaking killer and my leads are showing it, okay? I may not have tons of sales yet, but I'm planting hella seeds, okay? And then all I do is I take that whole email list, um, I use Flowdesk, so if you guys want the link for that, I'll pop it in all the chats. You guys can just literally click on that, go to Flowdesk. You get 30 days free and you can literally send as many emails as you want to as many people as possible. And then when it asks you to upgrade, you could just choose like they have email, checkout, and then both. You don't want checkout because you already have a site. You just do email. It's like, it's either 19 or $30. I don't remember. Um, but then you can, all I do is every week I go into my Arial app on the desktop save my entire contact list as um, a CSV file, upload it into Flowdesk. And what Flowdesk does is they'll delete duplicate emails. So you can literally just pop it in there. They'll delete all the ones that aren't, that don't matter. You just put them in a little category. I put them in like um, app update, or I put it in like um, Christina's VIP because my husband and I both have accounts. I put VIT, retail, retail, whatever. And then I can target who I'm sending what to, okay? So, this strategy works, guys. It really does. Um, Canva, if you don't have Canva, I that's a business write-off that you want. $12.99 a month is worth being able to do all this. If you're like, I'm not creative, no worries. It's fine. Some of us have different gifts and talents. That is one of mine. So I'm happy to share whatever I have. Um, or if you're like, hey, I don't have a graphic for this. Can you make it? Let me know. Because I'm in the process of making stuff. Um, but there's some things that I just don't, I just don't really tap on, but I'm happy to make the graphic, you know, you never know when you need it. So, um, that's basically all I do guys. If you have any questions, I'm sure there might be some in the chatty chat chat. Uh, let's see. I was going to say Canva has a lot of great options just for the free version too. Yes, absolutely. Um, when you go and do it, you just choose. That's what I used to do. I just choose the free options, but then I got frustrated because I was like, I want that cool thing. So I just upgraded, but Truly, you can do anything on there. You can make thumbnails, you can make graphics, you can make newsletters for your email, you can make videos, whether they're like YouTube style or like um, camera or phone screen size, you can make stories. I just made a really good amplified video um, on for stories. Um, and this is the other thing I'm gonna say guys, and this is something that I've been doing with my strategy is, you want to use your TikTok, your Reels, whatever, to gain a following and gain people to follow you. But then, here's the thing, be in your stories every day to be relatable, to be, like, people want to see that. When I, so I have a following, right? 
And when I posted on Saturday before I was going to speak on stage, I got 3,000 views on my stories. I've never had that many views on my stories ever. And I was like, oh my gosh, people are watching. They are watching. And the fact that I spent a day where I hardly posted and then I posted and it was something big, I had so many people looking, okay? I have people message me all the time that I never knew were watching. It's because I'm utilizing stories, okay? So use that story place to say, okay, this is where I'm connecting with people. This is where I'm being real. This is where I'm being relatable. And do not feel like I have to be all perfect and made up before you do it. I used to put the filter on guys. I used to put the filter on. I used to look like, say, oh my gosh, my hair has to be perfect. Screw that. I literally came on, took the filter off and said, you know what guys, I'm going to be real. I'm not going to wear the filter. I'm not going to do it. I'm going to show up as me. Even if I just woke up and my eyes are all puffy and I'm like this, people love it. People love it. I got so much more traction when I stopped being fake. I'm so excited for no filter. Cause now I can truly say I'm using no filter, you know, but Truly, show up as yourself. Just be raw, be real. You don't understand how many people have contacted me because you're like, you're so genuine and real. People want to see real. And it doesn't matter what stage of life you're in, even in the mess, share the mess. Because I'm telling you, people are like, oh my God, I'm alone. You're proving to them they are not alone, that they are going through th the same thing you went through. I guarantee you, there's somebody out there that's like, oh my gosh. There's no one in the situation like me. And you'll find a tribe of people who are exactly in the same spot you are. It's, it's wild, y'all. It's wild. I'm, I'm noticing every day so many people. And even on my team, the people that are on my team meeting each other, they're all having similar stories. It's, it's crazy. It's so crazy. So don't be afraid to put yourself out there. Don't be afraid to, you know, um, get raw and real. Because that's what we need. This Instagram versus reality crap. Like I can see a supermodel have like a hundred thousand followers or a million followers with her ass on Instagram. That's cool, but that's not going to get the masses. The masses want to know that, oh, Hey, I can literally be a hot freaking mess. Okay. Hot freaking mess. And I can do this and I can be successful. Facts tell stories sell. Okay. You can share all the facts in the world about our new gummy or our new vape, but people want to hear your story. Okay. Especially yellows. Yellows. I've had so many people that are like, I don't even care what's in it. I just want it because of your story. Okay. I'm telling y'all just share your story. So I think somebody popped a question in there. Do you make the video on the aerial app or different? App? Okay. So what I do is I will make the video itself on like, if it's a product video, like I showed you, I'll do it on Canva. And then what I do is I take that video and I put it in cap cut. And then I put the, the audio to it because Canva doesn't really have like good music. I don't even know if they have music. I don't, I don't, I don't know. But um, I take CapCut, it's free. It's, it's so similar to TikTok, how the editing is. Um, but when I make videos like Darnell was talking about, um, she used TikTok, which I do that too, but I also use CapCut because you can add different videos. You can add different sounds. If I'm trying to use a specific sound that I've heard on TikTok, I'll make it on TikTok. But realistically, you could just make it on your camera and just clip the pieces together in CapCut. And then you can put the words, you can do all the things. And then all you do is upload that to your app and then put whatever link buttons you want. I mean, it's really, it sounds like a lot of moving pieces, but this is what I tell my team. Put the work in now and get everything set up. Cause then when you go viral, or even if you just get a lot of traction, you're already set up. You're not typing the same thing over and over again. Like Darnell said she did. I did it too. And I was like, you know what? I don't have time for this. The whole reason I'm doing this business is so I have more time. So why am I wasting my time typing out a bunch of stuff when I could just literally save it in my clipboard? Like I might sound like a robot, but I always make sure to change it up. Like I'll be like, Hey girl, yes, this is my saving grace. Oh yeah, girl, you want to check this out. Like don't just copy paste the same thing over and over again, put it in there, but kind of do like a different variation of what you're doing so that it doesn't sound like you're just being spammy family because we don't like that either. Right. So hold on one second. Sorry, the kids in the way. Um, so yeah, if there's any other questions, I'd be happy to answer them, but that's that's really the gist of what I do. I didn't even think to use CapCut. That's a great idea too. I was just like, you know, I default to TikTok because it's simple, but you could, like I said, you, I just did it only me like upload and then it saves the video to my phone. Like, I don't care if it has my TikTok handle in my Ariel app, 
Good. Absolutely. Let them go follow me. I don't care that that shit's floating around in those videos. It's another reason for, oh, I, they don't follow me on TikTok. Let me go follow her on TikTok now. 100%. So that's another reason, like, that's, that's not a bad idea. But the cap cut is great, too. I didn't even think about that. I have it's that literally, too. it's literally TikTok changed their editing to mirror cap cut cap cut was created and yeah. then tiktok's like "Ooh, i like this and they they basically took the idea that's why cap cut is now linked with tiktok you can literally link the two we have all those templates mm -hmm. that's the other thing too y'all use them templates they are fire like the ones that like slow-mo you and flash and all that stuff i started doing that and taking my content that i was already creating but adding those in there and it gives like that extra flair because it people's like attention like spans. it makes you oh, look yeah, like you know what you're doing, doing. Yes, and I don't. Okay, no, I don't. No. I can't do all that. <laughs> but the access I can, it shows like I look like I'm doing. But and it's crazy because a video that you just did and you were like standing there like this, and you do this, literally, and all literally. of a sudden you look like a fucking glamour queen and like, I just like this. yeah, that's it. And it just for me. Seriously, yeah. don't overcomplicate this. Don't overthink yeah. it. So don't right. overthink it. So right. You're awesome, girl. Thank you for doing this. This was a great training. I can't wait to share this with everybody too. I'll give you, I'll upload it to YouTube and I'll get, send the link out to everybody so we have it, so we can share it. Like, absolutely. Such great, such great um, ideas. I love it all. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You're and welcome. I hope you have a beautiful weekend, friends. Kill it. Tomorrow, realistically, the audition starts again tomorrow, right? It flushes out Friday. So anybody yeah. can start signing up tomorrow in that audition. They get that full week. So, Push that starting tomorrow, friends. Have a great day.